telling you to grow up. <laughs> oh, conventions. <laughs> We're doing over too long. No such thing, no such thing. Um, I did, this was one that we saw at MomoCon, and it's so unfortunate because, you know, as cosplayers, we put so much effort into our costumes and into our props, and this guy at MomoCon did not, instead, instead of going to the other side of the food court and walking around, he, um, he pushed past a group that was getting their photo taken, knocked the Sailor Moon's prop off the table, and the prop broke, and it was, it was a wooden prop, and it, it snapped. And the girl was in tears. The guy didn't stop. He didn't apologize. But what he did, he picked it back up and he ran off. And I almost went out. I was mad. I was very angry. I was like, really? You didn't even apologize. Like, you put it back and you ran? Come on. That's not classy. Like, and he was there for, as a con goer. He had a badge. I was like, dude, you're a con goer. You should at least be able to respect someone else's, you know, things. You knocked it over. You should apologize. No such luck, unfortunately. Because <laughs> I have a ramble. Speaking about props, um, don't ever be afraid to ask for help. Because when I was at MomoCon, I had a big rocket launcher called Fish Boils from League of Legends. I was cosplaying as Jinx. And um, if you went to MomoCon, you know that you had to go uh, in this little hallway bridge. And there was people just going left and right, stopping and going and stopping and going. Well, I had this thing above my head, standing there just kind of like this, and everybody's moving and then they stop. And the guy behind me is probably like 6'5", so I hit him in the head with this thing. And I was like, I'm so sorry. He's like, do you want me to hold this? Because it's not only for your safety, but for mine. I was like, please go ahead. I actually saw that happen. That was a normal <laughs> <laughs> 